BMX 250, race two here at Lombardy at Mantova. Harkin Osterhagen with a flying start round the outside. And just behind him, Mike Werder, Raf Mewerson, and, and uh, Quinton Mark Prunier on the Kawasaki. But then a slight mistake there for Tondal. That allowed Vettik through briefly. Did find his way back onto the rear wheel, though, and into second position with that move on the Estonian. His teammate continued to lead, but not for much longer. The two came out of that turn side by side, and it was an easy move around the outside for Tondel, who was never headed after that moment. Vettik up the inside of Osterhagen, though, who had a momentary lapse in concentration for a few corners as he was pushed back to third. Meanwhile, Oriol Oliver charged down the inside of Dave Koika to move into fifth position and fast closing in on the pair of them and splitting them was the 44, the winner from race one, Rick Elzinger. Eventually made this move on Raf Mewerson to move into sixth as the two WZ Racing KTMs traded places. Oliver getting the better of his teammate Guerda. Then Elzinger around the outside of Guerda to move into fifth. He then went after the 10 of Oliver to move into fourth place and that's where the rider from the Netherlands would stay, but it was Cornelius Tundel who ran it out with the win in race two, followed by Miko Vettik and Hocken Osterhagen. Helsinger fourth, but that was good enough for him to take the overall victory here. Joining him on the podium, well, Rick Elzinger, your overall winner, Cornelius Tundel second, Hocken Osterhagen third, those two separated by a point but the Huttamatal Yamaha rider will leave here with the championship leader's red plate and of course he will look forward to round two and I'm sure the Fantic boys alongside him will as well. Rick Elsinger, congratulations. Winner in race one with a comfortable ride. Uh, not the best start race two, you had a bit more work to do but you do take the red plate to the second round. Yes, can, can be happier with the red plate. Uh, taking the win in the first round was uh, was one of the goals, you know. Uh, I've been training all the winter for it, and uh, and it shows what it did. So so happy, so that I can see what I, what we work for with the whole Hutton Yama Metals team, and uh, just glad to be here, and uh, I'm glad to be back on blue. Thanks a lot.